I'm not gonna fight these fucking dudes. I'm just gonna leave. Yeah, I do, do do what I did. This is what I just do. Skip in, everything. This is what I do in Breath of the Wild all the time. I'm like I'm just trying to go somewhere, and then all these enemies pop up, I'm like, and I'm like, nope, I'm not fighting you. I'm a Moglin, and you must fight. Oh, okay, bye. See, that's how you get around the whole stupid weapon durability shit too. Is you just don't fight anything. Yeah, because if you don't fight, you don't use your weapons. You know what? There's no no durability loss. Uh huh. Exactly. Go get the Master Sword. Go kill Ganon. Calamity Ganon. What's the difference? He's That's the thing. Use. Okay, so here's the thing, too. Here's the other thing that pisses me off with, like, Z- like Zelda games in general, right? I don't know what the plot of the, or, like, the basis of the new uh, Tears of the Kingdom game is, but I've been seeing people posting screenshots of Ganon. So, is that literally it? We're just fighting Ganon again? Every, every time. Like, every time, dude. Like, it's so fucking like boring he should have her uh, a turn uh heel turn and he should uh he should turn baby face and then <laughs> and then you fight with him i don't know like against this, zelda who's i don't know corrupted man. yeah there, there's just gotta be a twist in there somewhere to like make it like decently interesting other than like oh, just sweet. getting like you know princess zelda in fighting Ganon, and like it's the same mythos that has existed since the literal first fucking game it's like, oh sweet i get to fight <laughs> Ganon for the 10th fucking time <laughs> that's what i'm saying it's like is he just like you know an impervious is he's like the thanos of the world and like nobody can kill him yeah it's like why are like, you even fucking fighting him anymore like, yeah, he's just like, gonna come back exactly i don't know like i like i know just that's maybe, rule it. I, I, maybe that's nitpicky but i just think it's like the mario syndrome like it's like people play it because they like the, the quote-unquote like the story but it's like the story it's is the same, the same every time and there's always a f- like you know the same shit. There's always Death Mountain. There's always the the Zora place. There's always you know like the the desert. Like it's the same shit every time. This is like the only game with that exception. I feel, but I don't know. I mean, you're still fighting Ganon. You're still fighting Ganon. I I just mean it in the sense of like the world is different. Like, yeah. At least, like the world. I mean, is each like, world you know. is kind of different. Oh yeah, it is for sure. But yeah. it's also still in the yeah. same place. I'm, I'm technically. I'm painting with broad strokes here for sure, and I yeah. recognize that. But like, I don't know. It's just like, I don't know. If None you were of to summarize, were original, yeah, except for I, the first one. I was gonna say, if you were to summarize the plot and like, <clears throat> like very briefly, then every single one is gonna sound the same. <laughs> You know, that's my only thing. I, I wish that they would do something different with, like, you know, the the stakes and the story. Twilight Princess kind of did some interesting stuff with, like, the light and dark world shit and that, but, like, it still ultimately amounted to, hey, you got off white game. Because apparently there's no other bad people in this world. Yeah, only Ganon and these pigs. Pigs yeah. and Ganon. Those are the only ones who are evil. Yeah. I don't know. I know I'm nitpicking. I know I'm fucking just being a bitch, but I don't know. Those seagulls are uh, eating the body of another girl <laughs> who, didn't, who didn't last. <laughs> I don't know. I'm surprised that they haven't, like... I, I, I think, like, does Nintendo know also that there are people out there that enjoy other franchises that of theirs? Like, they did the, the, the Metroid Prime Remastered whole thing which i thought was interesting because they didn't even like announce it that much i think like when they announced it it was already out yeah it's a shadow release yeah which is fine i think that's great i think that's awesome because it's a then it's like i don't know like an interesting surprise for people right um and i think that game did pretty well sales wise i, I believe i don't know but like do people not do, does nintendo not realize that like people have been wanting an f-zero game since f-zero gx like 20 years ago <laughs> And they haven't made one. Yeah, F Zero. You know what I mean? What other ones did they make? They haven't fucking touched. I don't know. I think a, another like attempt at making a Star Fox game would be oh, interesting. Yeah. yeah, Star Fox died. They with did assault. Well, they, well, that, but they did Star Fox Zero. Oh um, yeah. For the yeah. Wii U, but nobody fucking bought the Wii U. You know. I think they've got enough IPs, like, they could do some interesting stuff with them if they decided to, but no, they they pull all the resources into the Zelda game, and then they pull all the resources into Mario or something, and that's it. So, I don't know. 
I just sound like a cry, a whiny crybaby. See, I don't care about the Mario games. I don't care I don't about either. those Zelda games. I don't anymore. either. I ain't a fucking baby. Well, because because they release them so often that it's like we get a fucking Zelda game like all the time. It feels like. And Mario games have the same problem of like Bowser's the bad big bad boss yeah, all the time. All the time. But every time there are at least some times where he isn't. Yeah. It's just nine times out of ten, Bowser is the big bad boss. Yep. And that's who you're gonna be fucking fighting at the end. Yep. Only in like Paper Mario or something like that. Yeah. Where like some of the more obvious games. Yeah. Yeah. Here's something else that's not a fucking Bowser fight. Shit. But this one, nah. It's just Ganon every just, fucking time. Just Ganon every time. Yeah, they have Calamity Ganon in, in Breath of the Wild, so that's like his punk form, I guess. And then he's like their proper in Tears of the Kingdom, I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I, I really don't know the full scope of it. But it, it just seems so formulaic. I, I think that's why I get so fucking hung up on like people giving the Zelda games yeah, like huge hundred, praise. Well, for like huge praise for like really like shit. yeah like. And, and and I understand that Tears of the Kingdom is kind of like an interesting twist on like the formula from like Breath of the Wild. I get that, like with the whole like construction shit. But yeah, like, but that's still, you know, it's it looks like it's the same game. Yeah, I'm sure there's gonna be something. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. Like, I'm, I'm sure there's cool shit. I'm not. I'm not trying to say that I think the game is bad. I just think that it's like if it, if it weren't called Zelda, I really just don't think that people would give it the same amount of praise but that's just me yeah so maybe i am trying to fucking find fault and shit i don't know i don't care if i am or not i'm at the Fuck. end of, we're at the end of the episode and i'm like triggered a boss fight so i guess we're doing this now <laughs> i'm triggered by the boss fight you just got smack bitch <laughs> you fucking smack bitch cook the man some fucking eggs bitch Oh, I thought you were doing a dive bomb. <laughs> All right, Taylor. Drop a bomb and then hit him with the hammer. Well, you gotta hit him with the hammer. No, both. No, you gotta drop hit him a bomb. Oh, you gotta hit him, hit him with, him the, with hammer. the hammer. You do You've both. Got to you get double the, the hit. Hammer. I'm telling you. I'm hundred <laughs> percent. Directo mundo. What the fuck, Taylor? Oh, way too late. I threw it pretty early. No, you gotta do it before he even fucking slams into the uh, the thing. Oh! You ran into the wall, you loser. <laughs> Dumb bird. That's why they call him Bird Brain. Why the, he had a pretty cool name. I forgot what his name was. But it's Draco like Malfoy. No, it's like something. <laughs> it's like something. <laughs> <laughs> this is what became of Draco Malfoy. <laughs> No, no, do it too. Oh, he's oh. flying away. Oh, he's bitch. He's gusting. He's, he's gusting because. Oh, that's the one corner you don't want to push me into because there's no spikes there. Damn it. Come on. Just land and take your fucking head. <laughs> yeah, like, we both know how this is going to end. You're not going to even touch me. I'm just gonna he hasn't so far. Yeah. I've taken zero damage. I'm just gonna crush your head in. Just fucking land. Take your loss. I don't even, do I have? No, I don't even have iron boots yet. If you have the iron boots, he can't even pick you up. He just goes. Oh. Just kind of like, how do I even at that point carry them? Go now. I'm a bird. my face. Gotta hit your dangler. Come on. Give me that dangler, dang. I'm gonna sweet chain music your goddamn face. Do it again. No, okay. oh, he's gonna fly away and then you gotta fucking dance on, around. Man. Shawn Michaels would have one shot at this fucking bitch. Yeah, he would have fucking stamped his foot. Luckily, I don't think. Yeah, I think that's it. Because I already did all the. I already pre-gamed him with the hammer, so. (laughs) 
Why are all these lights shining on it? Who told it? Yeah, right. Why did he go up to burn into a thing? I don't know. Um, I'm hoping that I can just save... I, th- I think I can... Can I just save the game here and we can quit? <laughs> <laughs> You've got a heart container. Good job. Or should we wait till the end of this inevitable cutscene that's going Yeah, let's just wait for the inevitable cutscene. All right, well, we'll save it here just to be safe. Anyway. Yeah, I know. Safe. Rather safe than sorry. I think we end up at... Uh, Windfall, maybe? We end up somewhere, because Ganon's up here just fucking jacking his ween. <laughs> you see that bird over there? <laughs> That's the idea of laughing like that. <laughs> Make mac and cheese. <laughs> it's been a while, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. You know, that bird was sneaking to my water and wriggle all the way up here. It's not much of a sneak when I, I kill the bird. I suppose the least I can do is for your reckless courage. My name is Gudoof. Gudoof? I am the master. <gasps> oh no, Gudoof. <laughs> I, I was looking for a guy named Ganador. By the way, when you learn so out of your pants, or did you by chance notice how all the monsters were that in time were not doing that anymore? Do you understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you A foolish do. child with that sword. It was banging at the same time, long play. <sighs> Short key, wrench. Wretched key, key kept seal magic. <laughs> By withdrawal blade, blade, broken seal. Broke seal. <laughs> he kills him right there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh. I was not expecting that. <laughs> I was not prepared. I'm gonna punch you. So you know what they could do? You know what they could fucking do? It would be kind of interesting if they really wanted to do something like more story driven and like a. I mean, this would probably be a completely different like. Uh, the power is Zelda gone. thing. But like, why? Don't you, how about you do like an origin story for Ganondorf? Like, like what if they did like a way prequel game? And, like, you see his, like, you play as him or something, and then you, like, do, like, like a fall from grace type deal. God, and, he, and, and then he learns how to, like, you know, he learns to, like, have disdain for the Hyrule family and shit. Yeah. Thus fueling the fire for his evilness. I don't know. Like, like Ganondorf, I don't think, was ever really explained in any capacity. He's just yeah, a he's dude. He's just a guy. He's just a dude. Yeah, he's just fucking there. I don't know. I'm sure there's some deep lore about his origin and shit, but, like, I don't know. Prince is okay. Like, that would be different, I guess. I don't know. Like, you know, at first he's, like, faithfully serving the Hyrulean, you know, kingdom. And then all of a sudden he's like, you guys stink. I want to be uh, I want to be Hyrule Kingdom King. Yeah, like, so, I don't know. I could, you know, maybe if he just came up with like a really good tax plan and <laughs> yeah, right. like a reason why get like democratically elected, I'm pretty sure he could do it. Right. Like, the, I'm sure the people seem like everything's good, but there's always a, a way to get even more change. Right. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I just think like, like there's got to be something more that they could do with like this world. I oh, just yeah. feel like it's so condensed. Yeah. Like, it, it, and it's like, it's like Star Wars. Like they just do the same shit every time. Like it always centers around the same group of people or like the same set of characters. And it's like, I don't know. I just think that there could be something more to it. Like you've got enough like freedom that you could like feasibly come up with something like more interesting than just oh Ganon's back we gotta fight him again yeah but I don't know maybe that's not the scope get, get of... the things go do the thing yeah like maybe that and maybe that's just it maybe I'm getting hung up on the fact that that's not what it is like that's like like Zelda is that <laughs> and that's all it is <laughs> but I don't know I'm a dragon my neck wouldn't actually Support my head. I would die immediately. Also, my wings are tiny. <laughs> Very tiny. Why? Why do we need like an under the gooch shot? <laughs> yeah. Right. All right. Let's fucking wrap this up. God. Why? We'll explain things later.
This is where we find out that Tetra is actually Zelda, as if it wasn't completely fucking obvious the entire goddamn game. Did you do anything to me while I was asleep? Why does my butt hurt? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that's what Zelda says. Or, sorry, uh, that's what Link says, the first, first, first <laughs> words. <laughs> Why does my butt hurt? <laughs> He's like, but, but I was God, the one that was asleep. Huh. It's probably this rock in my ass thing. <laughs> I had this ungrateful hunk of rock in my ass for seven years. <laughs> I used to call it my wife. <laughs> Let's do it next time on Chinstrap Chan. We get the Tingle Tuner and we call Tingle. No. <laughs> <laughs> I already got it. It's right there. <laughs>